Hey loves, welcome back to my channel. So today we're back with another video and thank you so much to McCart for sending me this amazing beautiful pink poly gel kit in regards to breast cancer awareness month that is from october 1st through october 31st so here i'm just quickly and briefly showing you everything that the kit includes So this is what the kit includes absolutely beautiful i love the aesthetic of it my favorite color is pink so i definitely just fell in love with this entire poly gel kit so as i'm showing you everything that it includes i just wanted to say that my heart goes out to everybody who has undergone any sort of cancer along with breast cancer awareness but just anyone who's undergone it who survived it or who is going through it my heart definitely goes out to anyone in that situation i don't know if you guys know but a long time ago i did mention that i am currently um undergoing the hardest moments in my life right now because unfortunately my mother is undergoing stage four cancer and um i'm not gonna get into details about everything but i just wanted to say that my heart definitely goes out to anyone undergoing it who has survived it or is experiencing it right now it's very tough and let me tell you, it is one of the hardest things that I um, have gone through in my life. Um, you know, you can always try to have better days than others, but at the same time, it's like it's always in the back of your head. Subconsciously, consciously, it is always there. And some days are easier than others, but I just wanted to share that with you all. Um, I had a set in the past a very long time ago. Um, it's we've been going through this for like a year already so um yeah let's just hope for the best but i don't want to make this video a sad video and i don't want pity or anything but since it's in regards to breast cancer awareness that's why i went and shared my story but here i'm just going in with my silicone hand that i did purchase through dynamic nail supply it was 30 dollars with shipping and everything was 46 and honestly i was really happy with it at the end it works great i mean very inexpensive and definitely a very realistic looking hand so here i am just going in and applying the poly gel usually i never do it like this like the poly gel with um nail tips but i said you know what i do want to incorporate more sets on myself so that's why i got this hand and um it's the flexible one my other iguana one when i got it at the time i didn't really know much about anything so i didn't end up getting the posable one which is a really big problem when you're trying to film tutorials so that's why i went ahead and got a more affordable one that is posable so here i'm just gonna go in and briefly show you the process so i hope you guys enjoyed today's video let me know down below in the comments what you guys thought about today's nail look and hit that notification bell if you haven't already to never miss out on any of my uploads and subscribe if you haven't already it would mean the world to me and thank you guys so much for all the love and support that i have been receiving throughout my entire um nail journey i really appreciate it, it means so much and thank you so much to my card as well for always considering me and sending me over some pr really really grateful and appreciative of that so here I'm just going to continue the process of this poly gel set. So for the ring finger, I decided to mix all the poly gel colors together and make like a marble mix. So that is what I'm doing here on my mixing plate and then I'm going to go over and transfer it over onto the nail.
And by the way, this way of doing poly gel with tips is not easy at all for me. It definitely took me hours. I think I started at around 5 and it was close to 8 and I had just finished. So it definitely is a learning experience for me doing poly gel with tips. But I just love being able to learn and get better and better each time. So in no way near shape or form are these like the best set of nails. But I am trying my best. So yeah it's all a learning experience and from my experience it isn't easy for me to do it this way but i definitely want to venture out and try to better um myself in doing poly gel with tips So now I'm going to go ahead and apply top coat to all the nails and then I'm going to go and add the rest of the things that I'm going to be doing to the set. And by the way, for the middle finger, I decided, not the middle finger, for the ring finger, I decided that I was going to apply some butterflies and through the little butterflies, they were going to create the breast cancer awareness ribbon. So you guys will see the process of me doing that. I do use a very fine detailed brush with some white gel polish.
so now i'm just going in with some charms that i decided that i wanted to place on the nail and to adhere these i did use the eno couture gummy jelly and now i'm using the eno couture cuticle oil and this smells so so good i absolutely love this so i'm just gonna apply some cuticle oil onto the hand and that is it for today's video thank you guys so much for watching i appreciate each and every one of you all and i'll see you in the next upload